I've got four fruit trees in this garden. There's a Bramley seedling there, a Victoria plum there, a Cox's orange pippin there, and a conference pear there. It's now late October, and in November, the females of the winter moth can climb up the trees and lay eggs on the branches and then the caterpillars of the winter moth can eat the um, developing buds on the trees. So it's a very good time of year to put some protection around the bottom of the trees and uh, I'm going to put um, some grease about 18 inches from the bottom of each tree. Winter moths don't have wings at this stage, which is why they're able to climb up the trees. This is sometimes done with grease bands, which are held onto the tree, but that with them um, bands. But this very much depends on how smooth the bark is, because clearly, if the bark is all very knobbly, then the female moths can climb up behind the band. So I find that using this um, fruit tree grease, special for, special grease um, for, for a purpose, is a much better and more comprehensive way of doing it. You'd need to do it maybe about 18 inches off the ground and obviously all the way round. And the other thing to remember is that if you've got a younger tree staked, you need to do the stake as well, or the, the moths will take the, the back door. The other good thing about this is you don't have to worry about washing your brush out. This brush has been used for many, many years, and when I finish, I'm just gonna leave it with the pack of grease, as is, and it will be flat, it doesn't dry, it'll be, flexible and ready to use straight away the next time I need it.